Hi, and welcome to this episode of Mastering Manufacturing. Today, we're going to be talking about Ultim 1010 for 3D printing. But before we start, don't forget to subscribe. Ultim was originally developed by General Electric Plastics Division, now SABIC, in the early 1980s. Ultim 1010 is a plastic material that is used in industrial FDM 3D printing. It offers the highest level of heat and chemical resistance of any FDM thermoplastic. Ultim 1010 stands out from other high-performance polymers because it is uniquely designed to remain mechanically stable under extreme conditions. What kind of material is Ultim 1010? Ultim 1010 is a trade name for PEI. Polyetheramide is an amorphous amber to transparent thermoplastic that is very similar to PEAK. However, Ultim costs about a third of what PEAK costs. The polymer hardens in a cross-linked pattern that prevents it from remelting even under extreme heat. The glass transition temperature of PEI is 217 degrees Celsius or 422 degrees Fahrenheit. Ultim's ultimate tensile strength is 48 to 81 megapascals. Impact strength is 32 joules per meter. Now, for the most important part, what are the benefits of Ultim 1010 and why would you use it? First, its strength. Its strength is between 48 and 81 megapascals. That's why it's often used in the transportation industry. Ultim actually holds several aerospace certifications and is FDA compliant. Second, Ultim 1010's heat resistance. Ultim 1010 can withstand temperatures upwards of 217 degrees Celsius for extended periods of time and remain dimensionally stable through fluctuating temperatures. Ultim 1010's glass transition temperature is 217 degrees, making it perfect for steam autoclaving. That's why many medical professionals use instruments such as surgical guides made from Ultim. Electrical component manufacturers use Ultim in insulation parts, connectors, chip test sockets because of its high heat resistance. Next, its chemical resistance. Amorphous thermoplastics have the tendency to crack when they come into contact with fats and oils from foods and fluids used for servicing cars and aircrafts. Ultim 1010, however, is resistant to a wide range of chemicals such as automotive fluids, alcohols, acids, aliphatic hydrocarbons, and aqueous solutions. Not only can Ultim resist stress cracking when coming into contact with these fluids, but it's also highly resistant to ultraviolet rays and gamma radiation. It has a really good FST score. Ultim 1010 is inherently flame resistant. It's really hard to ignite with a limiting oxygen index, or LOI, of 47%, meeting UL94 V0 specifications in sections as thin as 0.41 millimeters. Ultim 1010 generates extremely low smoke per the NBS smoke evaluation test. Lastly, unique certifications. The certified grade of this material is biocompatible and approved for food contact with NSF 51 and ISO 10993 USP Class 6 certifications. That means you are able to use them in parts that handle food preparation or even put it inside the human body. Good to note is that Ultim is the only FDM material that is NSF 51 certified. However, keep in mind that FDM printed materials have layers, which means a lot of surface area for bacteria. That's it for our episode on Ultim 1010. I hope you enjoyed it and learned something new. There's a lot more we didn't cover in this video, but if you've got any questions, please put them in the comments below and we'll be sure to respond to them. I hope you like, subscribe and tune in for the next video. Take care guys.